associated with those vehicles. Looks like they're gearing it up. Looks like they're gonna start putting rounds towards Warbath. Copy. My job is I am a TAC P and the United States Air Force, and my job is to call in uh, close air support uh, in support of the Army. Elevation 1970 feet. To me, uh, as we pack personnel and uh, armor moving into that area. The mission was that this airfield that was uh, held by U.S. forces was overran. Uh, friendly forces were taken into the most center building, um, the hangar building. My job out here was to prosecute all enemy activity and all enemy uh, targets so we could allow forces, freedom of forces to move into uh, the target area and to secure the friendlies and call in Medivac 9 lines. Right. Right now we all have small arms man pads in the target area. Um, you're approved uh, 1,000 to 18 block. So this was my uh, initial eval to get my JTAC qualification. Can't tell the vehicles haven't moved since the last attack from Warbat, but we've got personnel moving, moving in that area. Is that area copy? Right now, as long as I have uh, met all uh, learning objectives and DLOs, um, I still have a couple more objectives I need to accomplish before getting my official JTAC uh, qualification. Um, so after that, um, I'll, I'll get that cert. Copy all. Level, Level delivered. delivered. Calling with uh, heading to clinical and final one two. Because what it does, it makes me an operational JTAC, which then that means I can deploy and and essentially be that, that force multiplier for the army. And from uh, Bennett two three standby, we got a new target set for you to use the uh, lives on standby. Copy. 